it's Tuesday the 3rd of December uh, and it's uh, the beginning of a new sitting block uh, for three weeks uh, leading up into Christmas. Uh, pretty normal start to the day today with uh, oral questions. Uh, Mark Patterson, the Associate Minister of Transport, about regional roading. Uh, Simon Bridges has questions to and for both to the Prime Minister, both asking about whether she stands by uh, her government's statements and actions. Uh, Maya Lubeck uh, to the Minister of Education uh, about investments uh, in schools uh, to modernise. Uh, Paul Goldsmith, the Minister of Finance, about policies and actions. Uh, Duncan Webb uh, to the Minister of Finance about reports on the economy. Brett Hudson to the Minister of Police uh, about uh, keeping information secure. Uh, Louise Upston to the uh, Minister for Employment about mana mahi. Um, the Angie Warren Clark, the Minister of Health, about the cost of access to primary health care. Uh, Jerry Brownie, the Minister of Foreign Affairs, uh, about a statement made by the Russian government. Uh, Shane Retty, to the Minister for Arts, Culture and Heritage, uh, around data breaches. And Kiritapu Allen, to the Minister of Civil Defence, uh, about the National Emergency Management System. Uh, we will then go on to legislation, starting with the International Crimes and uh, International Court Amendment Bill. Uh, this is a first reading, but it's an unusual first reading in that it doesn't have a debate uh, because it's a result of a treaty uh, and therefore goes straight off to the Foreign Affairs and Defence uh, Select Committee. Then we'll do the Referendums Framework Bill, the third reading of that. After that, uh, there will be uh, another bill introduced, the detail of which uh, I can't give you at the moment, and it's likely that we'll spend quite a lot of time on it. And we'll almost certainly be back uh, at the same time uh, tomorrow uh, for Wednesday.